As hard as it may be to actually imagine, some people, some people do not want to lose weight. Some people may want to gain weight. But actually trying to lose weight or gain weight may be one of the reasons you are not getting the results you want. Because weight, weight is essentially just one marker of progression, a number on the scales. And we look at our success of our health as, oh, I've gained a little bit of weight, I've lost a little bit of weight, or I've stayed the same, based on this number on the scales. But there is always, there's always an underlying reason as to why, as to why you want this result. And that's where we want to look a little bit deeper because losing weight, gaining weight, staying the same, getting healthier is very much generalized. And when we generalize something, it is generally not going to come into fruition. You want to lose 20 pounds, you want to lose 30 pounds, you want to gain 10 pounds, you want to gain 20 pounds. I just want to feel a little healthier. What is healthier? How are you going to track that? And yes, I get weight loss can be tracked with the number going down on the scales, but what are you doing? You are losing fat. When you are gaining muscle, when you are building up your weight, or you are simply trying to rehydrate to get your weight up, get your glycogen stores in your muscles, there is always something going on. But what's happening up here? How are you gonna feel? How are you gonna feel when you actually get to the weight you want to be? Why is that a goal? Why that specific weight? Most of the time it is down to increasing your energy, Increasing your focus, increasing your confidence is the biggest thing. Not just confidence in conversations with people on a face-to-face -face basis, but that confidence. The confidence in your relationships. A lot of people don't like to admit it, but they want to lose weight. Maybe they're single and they want to attract the opposite sex. Or they want to lose weight or gain weight or drop fat or gain muscle to gain this confidence because... They simply want their partner to look at them like. They want their partner to look at them like they used to do when they first met. That glare in their eyes. The awareness of how amazing this person was. They want that confidence in their relationships to be built. The confidence to know that you've got the energy. That you can actually take your children out. Not get out of breath. Not get worn out. Or when you're sitting on the sofa and the toddler is there and they prod you in your belly and they say, Daddy's squishy. Because children don't lie. They don't know to keep someone's feelings in check. They don't know how to do that. They just speak the truth. And while at the time you may laugh, at the time your family may giggle and make a joke out of it, that shit can hurt. I know that for a fact. When people just joke about and they prod you or something and say, oh, you're putting a couple of pounds, that shit can hurt. It's horrible, really horrible, when you're trying everything you can do. But how do you get there? What are your goals gonna be and how do you get there? The way to do it is essentially work backwards. You wanna be at 20 pounds? Okay, this is what I gotta to do to get five pounds lost, 10 pound lost, 15 pounds lost. These are the small changes. Hydration, I need to get more water in, I need to get more movement, I need to get better quality food, I need some accountability. But stop just simply saying I wanna lose weight. Once we are honest with ourselves, and that conversation is hard, that conversation is really hard to have with ourselves. And it's also hard to have with someone else. I've had multiple clients we've had to really dig into why they want these goals. And if it's weight loss for a fight, cool, that is 100% okay. It's not necessarily for health, it's for a specific event in the sporting world. But if you want to just look into why you want to do something, then drop me a message, we can do that. And to see if there's a way of going about it that is actually going to make you feel great quickly. Because essentially that is good going to be the deciding factor for you to continue on the route towards your goal. Small wins consistently.
I look forward to speaking to you.